So today we're doing some dot art and for this you need to choose some paint colours. Here we've got gold, yellow, pink and silver. Um, paper, black or white, doesn't really matter. Um, some cotton buds, kebab sticks and a pencil. So I'm going to use the white paper. Um, first off you need to decide what shape you're going to do. So we're just going to do a nice simple teardrop. So if you draw that out on your paper first, it's not a very good teardrop, but that will do. Um, and then you take your cotton bud and decide what colour you're going to go with first. We'll go gold. Dip the cotton bud into the paint. And then you're simply just doing dots. So you want to hold it straight up and down and dot. And you probably need to leave a little bit of a gap between each dot in case you want to do something in between it. So you'll probably get two to three dots out of each dip in paint. Depends on how bright you want it to be. And you just keep dotting. Dot, 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 dot. <laughs> so that's our first line outline done. Now we're going to move on to the next colour. And I'm going to use pink paint with the blunt Which end of a kebab stick. Why am I pumped? So we'll just dip it in there. In. and same as before but kind of in between where you've put those other dots go back over those ones not quite dark enough So that's our second row of dots done and we're just working our way into the center of the teardrop. So now we're going to do yellow paint with a cotton bud again and just the same as the last two lines. We get some paint on the end of our stick and straight up and down dot in between where we've done the pink dots. In the gaps. All the way around. So we've just jumped ahead and carried on with our pattern of colours working into the middle. So I'm just going to finish off this last little pink in the middle. And then we're going to grab another kebab stick and the silver and we're going to use the pointy end to get a fine little dot. And we're going to go, where are we going to go? We're going to go in between all the pink and yellow. So 
So this one will need you to dunk each time. Yeah, each time just to get enough. So I'm going to carry on going through in between all the pink. So as you can see, I've gone through and done all the silver dots in between the pink. Um, now I would leave that to dry for a day or two. Um, if you were going to do this in a, in a classroom, you'd probably want to do a couple of lessons to get it all done properly. But your imagination is your limit, really. Um, this is another one we've done earlier on this week. On black paper, a bit of in a different effect. And this is another that is a work in progress. So as I said, your imagination is the only thing that will limit you and what you can or can't do with dot art.